Greetings, it's me, St. Nicholas, the real life Bishop of Myra. And I'm here in this beautiful Trinity Episcopal Cathedral. I'm the patron saint of just about everybody. Bankers, prisoners, sailors, especially children, and therefore Christmas. December 6th is my feast day. There are heaps and heaps of stories about me. Perhaps you know the one about the three daughters and the three bags of gold. Or maybe, uh, maybe the story about how I came to be associated with candy canes. Or how I helped to write the Nicene Creed. If you haven't heard of, of those stories, I'll tell you about them another time. Right now, I want to tell you about how I came to be bishop. My selection as bishop was a bit unusual. Here's what happened. When the old bishop died, we were all very sad. But a group of bishops got together to select the next bishop. While he was sleeping, the oldest and wisest bishop heard a voice saying, in the morning, look to the front doors. The first person to come in will be the new bishop. I'm not certain if that's the way I would pick a bishop, but when the time came, they all looked toward the front door. Guess who? They asked me my name. I said, I am Nicholas. And they said, Nicholas, friend and servant of God, for your holiness and your devotion, you will be made bishop in this place. They brought me into the church and sat me in the bishop's chair, and I was consecrated Bishop of Myra. I wonder if that has anything to do with the early bird gets the worm. But what about you? What will you do to be a good servant of God? Will you be first through the door? or the last. These are trying times, but we'll get through them together. And we need each other now more than ever. I want to send God's blessing to each and every one of you and to wish you and everyone you love the happiest Christmas you've ever had. Bye now.